Let's take a question on electrostatics. In this question, we have given two spheres having radii A and B. The volume between these two spheres is filled with charge density rho is equal to A upon R, where A is a constant and R is the distance from the sphere. At the center of this sphere, a charge Q is placed. And what should be the value of A such that the electric field in this region between the spheres is constant? So let's say this is the sphere having radius small r. Then the charge enclosed in this sphere, let's say it is Q dash, which is equal to Q which is the point charge inside this region plus the charge due to the volume charge density from the region A to R. So we write the integral A to R into rho into the area that is the surface area of the sphere which is 4 pi R square into dr which is the infinitesimal thickness of the sphere. So we have Q plus integral a to r. Now rho is a upon r into 4 pi r square into dr. Solving this we get q plus 2 pi capital A into r square minus 2 pi capital A into small a square. Now from Gauss law we know that the charge enclosed inside the region is given by charged enclosed upon epsilon naught is equals to E dot A where A is the surface area of the region and E is the electric field present. So E is the electric field. and A is the surface area. So from above we can see that the charge enclosed in this region of radius R we have Q dash upon epsilon naught is equals to E dot 4 pi R square. Now Q dash as we got from this equation is Q plus 2 pi A into R square minus 2 pi A into A square. So we substitute the value of Q dash here to get Q plus 2 pi A R square minus 2 pi A into A square upon epsilon naught is equals to E into 4 pi R square. Dividing both sides of the equation by 4 pi r square, we get E is equals to, we just have flipped this equation and written E on the left hand side. So we get E is equals to Q minus 2 pi A into A square upon 4 pi r square into epsilon naught plus half of A upon epsilon naught. Now it's given in the equation that in the question that electric field is constant so it's independent of R so this term has to be zero because this term is dependent in R so this term has to be zero so we have Q minus 2 pi A A square is equals to zero so A is equals to Q upon 2 pi small a square. So the value of A comes out to be Q upon 2 pi a square.